Hey guys, Craig Caron here. Hey, I just want to cut the short video for you guys, and I want to introduce you guys to the new Facebook search graph. Um, if you guys um, don't know what the Facebook search graph is, it's something that Facebook is coming out with um, really shortly here. Um, there is a way to, to get in as a beta tester, and obviously I got approved to be a beta tester for this new uh, search graph, but um, if you are wanting to get in on this right now um, this is what you need to do just go to Google here guys and just type in Facebook search group okay oh I'm sorry Facebook search group uh, Facebook search graph we're gonna go over a little um, little few things that I've been kind of messing with uh, with the Facebook search graph but what you need to do is just go into the site here and just scroll down all the way to the bottom and then just click this button that says try graph search and um, I don't know exactly how they're approving people or what you know what kind of criteria you have to fit under um, but um, it took me about a week to get approved so about two weeks or so so go ahead and get in there and that way you can get started you know as a beta tester before you know anybody else um, you know, before they actually launch it okay so anyway let's go over the graph a little bit it's actually really 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 Cool. All right. Uh, and what I, and you know, usually when things are really cool for me, it, that means they have to be really cool. Um, I use a, I used to use a lot of software to search things, um, but I think this is going to be the next way to search. I mean, Google does their thing, Bing does their thing, but this is totally off the charts. I mean, there's nothing that really competes with this at all. And I think the more and more people that are using Facebook to, you know, to conduct their searches, um, I think this is just the. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. I think this is just going to be like the new best thing, okay? Because uh, there's nothing out there that compares to the way you can search for for people or search for restaurants or search for whatever you want, All right? So let's go up here and check this out for a little bit. All right. So as you can see, when I uh, click on it, it basically you know goes through like my friends photos of my friends restaurants nearby which that could be really powerful um, you know if you get into the local marketing scene this could be really powerful maybe say you want to start um, you know help people with their you know restaurants with their um, fan pages or whatever if they don't have a fan page you can find all these restaurants and even if they do have a fan page maybe they don't have one that's really good right so here's what I did yesterday just to uh you know go in and and try these things out okay what i did was i typed in computer shops i think it was computer shops in my area shops in my area and now they have also the web so you can actually search not just on facebook but you can also search on uh, bing as well and i know that this uh, I know they didn't have any, um, like anything as far as, um, you know, the computer shop that I went for, it, they don't have anything um, online. Like they have a website, but it's so old. Um, not just that, but let's try something else here. I think I must, I know I put something in like that. I think maybe it was computer shops. All right, so let's see if I can find it here. I don't know what I did yesterday. I did something yesterday. It popped right up. But anyway, so I found this computer shop, and uh, they didn't have, like, a fan page. Their website was just, like, awful. As a matter of fact, I'll uh, actually show you. It's called Horizon. Actually, let's look to see if they even have. Let's go to the. Oh, that's not it. 
But anyway, um, this is a, a computer shop that I found yesterday. And uh, it was actually kind of cool because they have a website that was just horrible. So I contacted the guy yesterday. Um, he's got a, the guy has a web designer. Matter of fact, let's just Google him. I don't remember exactly what the search I put in, but I'm going to show you some search terms that you can put in too, which is really cool. Um, So anyway, you can look at their website. It's just kind of boring and drab. I mean, there's really not much to it, right? Pretty ugly looking website. So, um, and not just that, but there's like some errors on this site as well. Um, yeah, there's some errors on this website as well. So anyway, so I contacted the guy yesterday. Um, he told me his web designer was like just totally gave up on him and things like that. So he was looking for somebody. Um, so anyway, I got in contact with the guy and, um, you know, it was pretty easy to make the sale. Say, well, hey, I'm a web designer. I'm really, you know, reasonable priced and things like that. He told me, you know, how much would it cost to fix the whole website? And I was like, uh, well, you know, I would rather design the website, you know, because um, it's kind of old. You know, it looks like it's from the 90s and. He's like, yeah, you're right. So we worked out a deal, and it was kind of a cool deal, you know. So, I mean, those, that's just some of the things you could do. But anyway, check this out, guys. All right, so um, let's go back to the homepage here. So as you can see, you can search for, obviously, your friends. You can search for photos uh, of your friends, uh, restaurants nearby, games my friends play, music my friends like, photos I have liked. Um, and then you can do more, too. Um, friends of my friends. So if you want to view like friends of your friends, um, places my friends have been to, um, apps my friends use, I mean, current cities my friends. So it's just totally crazy. Um, so let's just say that we wanted to uh, go to my friends here. Okay. And check this out, guys. I mean, this is how powerful this is. Okay. Um, so let's say that you wanted to. Uh, just refine your search, okay? Just say you wanted to just do all your male friends, okay? So it's going to pop up all your male friends. Let's say that, um, let's say that you wanted to just target people from your city, okay? So let's just say, um, uh, let's just do North Carolina. Okay, nobody from my friends are from Kannapolis. <laughs> let's try, um, Let's try other. Let's just put in Charlotte. So somewhere close by, right? So as you can see, these are all my friends from Charlotte that are on my friends list now. Um, so maybe. So now we can remove that. Now let's do. Let's say that you wanted to. Um, let's see here. Do certain. Maybe you want to do from Canada or something like that. Or maybe from your hometown. So let's see how many people are from Schaumburg. Oh, nobody. Nobody likes me. All right, so let's remove that. I got no friends from my hometown. That's crazy. All right. So um, let's see here. You can also do it from, like, my close friends, friends of my friends. So let's say... Um, you wanted to find people that were, you know, or you want to look up people that were friends of your friends. And these are people that, you know, maybe potentially you can contact or whatever. Um, I mean, there's just so much potential with this, guys. Um, it's unbelievable. But I'm going to show you guys something powerful here in a little bit. Because this is what I'm going to start doing. And this is what I've already started doing, uh, which is totally crazy. So, um <coughs> So anyway, there's so many things that you can do with this. So let's, for instance, say um, say you're looking for um, my non-friends who like marketing, okay? Let's try that. Oh, 
Okay, so let's cross that out. I don't want that. None friends. Say people that I wanted to look for that like my fan page. Okay, so non my non friends um, who like Family Network. Let's just put that. That's not good. Oh, I put it put work. All right, let's try that again. Who like Family Network? So, as you can see, these are all people that actually liked my fan page at one time, right? And this is pretty cool. Um, so you can, like, refine your search and, you know, basically just, you know, contact them. I mean, there's so many things that you can do with this, guys. I'm not even, like, like rubbing the surface here, guys. So if you want to just find people, like I said, you can do male or female. Let's say you just want to do females that like Family Networker. Okay, and you can see it even should show like more than 100 people um, that are your non-friends that are female that actually like Family Networker. So this is pretty cool. All right. Um, you know, you can send messages to people from here, view their photos, interests, all types of stuff, guys. Um, let's look at some other things, guys. Um, Say we want to find friends. Who like? Video marker. Let's just put video marker. Let's try that. Okay, these are all people that are doing their thing. How about we just do this? Friends who like. Maybe, maybe my company, okay? So we can put friends who like Global MPN, uh, friends who like MLM leads, whatever. So, I mean, this is just a lot of potential. I, like I said, I'm just, I'm still new to this. I just started working with this yesterday. But, I mean, there's so much potential to search. But here's the, the cool way, the other cool thing. You can search keywords as well, just like you could on anything else. Um, or just like you could on Google and other places. But check this out, guys. This is what's going to be really, really powerful. So let's say that you were just going to search internet marketing. Okay. What's going to happen, it's going to show all these different groups and fan pages, things like that, okay, um, or companies, okay. It's also going to show fan pages and things like that and groups. But just think how powerful this is going to be when people actually put in you know, their search terms, okay? So what I did yesterday is I just wanted to test this out yesterday, and I went on um, Google to, to look for um, some cool keywords, right? And I found one just called MLM Leads, okay? And it gets, like, tons of searches a month, okay? Um, I looked under exact search, and it was tons of, you know, different searches uh, or um, tons of views every month, right? So what I did was I created a fan page around it, and if I type in MLM Leads, you can see my website comes up or my fan page comes up first because I named it. What did I name it? I named it MLM Leads. Okay. But there's going to be other criteria, obviously. I mean, other people are going to be doing this and they're going to be competition. But I'm getting mine out there right now. I'm getting mine out there fast um, before this even launches because think about it. If people are typing MLM Leads, what's going to happen? They're all going to be coming to my fan page, right? I'm going to be signing up to my offer, whatever. You know, maybe I'm giving something away for free or I'm teaching people how to get MLM leads, whatever, okay? Um, and it was really just that simple. I haven't even set the fan page yet. But as you can see, this is my fan page that I'm starting on. But um, if you come over here, let's just go to Google real quick. We'll just type in Google Keyword Tool. Like I said, I'll probably do another update on this as I learn this a little bit more, but... For right now, I mean, this is just amazing what you can do with this, guys. Um, let's just type in MLM leads. If I can spell this right, it'd be okay. All right, let's try this. 
Okay, so let's go to exact search month. Okay, so MLM Leads has 4,400 searches of, you know, exact um, searches every month, right? But check that out. I mean, that's a lot of searches. So when people are searching on, you know, Facebook or Google, but ch check this out. Like, we already know Facebook, you know, ranks high in the search engines. So, you know, if I build this page up right, I could also be in Bing. I could also be in Google because, you know, Facebook, obviously, is going to, you know, rank high in the search engines. So if I do this right and fill out, you know, my content right, you know, SEO-wise, I can rank really high for that keyword. So just like YouTube, you know, if you're doing YouTube videos, same thing. Um, but this is just some awesome stuff, man. Um, I, I don't, I, like I said, I don't know a whole lot yet about it. I'm just kind of doing my research on this. But, you know, um, like I said, you can search. This is, here's another cool one. Okay, groups my friends are in. So, as, you know, we all know that, you know, groups are just huge, guys, for getting leads and things like that. I use groups all the time, um, you know, for getting leads. So, um, I mean, just look at this stuff, guys. You know, network marketing. Um, I mean, you know, I'm not endorsing any of these, you know, groups, guys. I'm just kind of giving you um, a way to find groups that your friends are in, um, ways that you can go in and, you know, just kill it, okay? Like when, you know, I'm in um, Jason Parker's group. Jason, uh, I don't think any of my really friends are in that group. Let me check. <laughs> Excuse me. Got the hiccups. I don't think so. But, you know, that group is awesome because I've pulled in so many leads from that group. It's amazing how many leads I've pulled in. Just to prove it to you, uh, let's just go to Jason Parker's group. All right, so let me just go ahead and search my name real quick. Search my name. That's all on Tuesday. I haven't really been doing much in the group lately, but man, I'm telling you, this group is just crazy. Um, the amount of people that I have pulled from this group not doing anything now, okay? I haven't really done anything except just comment, okay? I'm not putting my links in and spamming links like you see a lot of these groups that do. Um, not doing any of that stuff, okay? Okay, let's see. So let's go to this one real quick. This is a food for thought that I did. I just put it on here, okay? It's just basically a regular post. I just put it on here, and as you can see, I mean, tons of people are commenting on this. Um, tons of people are liking this. It's just kind of crazy, okay? Um, just different things you can do to engage people to like you and engage people to show that, you know, hey, you're an authority, you know, in whatever niche that you're presenting yourself in, okay? So let's look at some more stuff here, guys. I mean, like I said, this is just, groups are powerful, guys. And, um, you know, I've been pulling in tons of leads from groups, um, not really doing anything, just going in there and commenting and showing off my, uh, my knowledge. And that's all I've been having to do is just show off my knowledge. And I'm telling you, people are just, they kind of bond with you because they can relate to you. Okay, so let's see. Let's see what else we got here. Um, this guy here, uh, free information, credit control rocks, great guy, great information. Um, just tons of uh, endorsements too. People endorse you when you give out good stuff, okay? So it's pretty crazy. Okay, let's go back up here. Some of the stuff that's up here further. Like this one here. Oh, here's the one I did. Okay, so January 19th, I, 
I wrote this one. It says, hey, everyone, if you picked up Jason Parker's 2013 game plan. So I gave him recognition, okay, on his own group and read some of his techniques for finding solo ad vendors. I've been doing some research on some other places. And if you haven't heard of ironreportcard.com, this is a great place to find and contact vendors, okay? So I just went into how to contact other solo ad vendors. You can see a lot of people um, were just, you know, commenting uh, or uh, liking this and a few people commented. But um, it's kind of cool, man. I mean, there's a lot of cool things you can do with this. But here's what the killer part is. If I go into my messages here, just go in and let's see all okay so let's check uh, it's all these people man I'm telling you um, let's see here a lot of these people are just from that group asking me to um, you know ask me for my links um, all types of stuff like for instance let's go to this one here Let's go to the beginning. We had some long conversations. So she asked me in the group um, for my links, to, you know, for my link to when I was in Power Results and things like that. And we had a long conversation, of course, you know, we talked a little bit. Um, this guy here, same thing. He asked me, um, you know, give me your affiliate link for the autoresponder you use. Um, same thing with this guy here. He wanted to, uh, and and here's the cool part: it's all these guys, all these people that were asking me, got into my business. Okay, like um, this guy here, uh, Brandy, she got in. Um, this guy's thinking about it. This guy got in. Or this guy's thinking about it. Sorry, um, Ernie, he's bought some things from me. Um, so it's just been like totally cool, man. Like. People just coming in and asking me for my links and things like that. So it's just been totally rocking, man, and I love it. So anyway, guys, I mean, that's just kind of the power of groups and the power of this Facebook search. Um, as I learn more about this Facebook uh, graph search, you know, I'll definitely be letting you guys know. Um, and, you know, anything that I find, of course, I'm going to send it to you guys. But anyway, got, get in there, guys. You know, go to Google and type in Facebook graphic search. Get in there and, and sign up for it. It should take like two weeks or so um, to get approved. I, like I said, I don't know how they approve people, but just get in there anyways. I mean, this is just awesome. This is going to be great for searching. And Like I said, if you um, you know come in here and, and you have local businesses and things like that, um, you know, I mean, think about it. How powerful it would be, okay? Like, let's say you have a local business, and let's say the business is called Joe's Crab Shack or something. You know, you could go and set up a fan page, set it all up, right? And then sell it to the company, okay? Um, all types of stuff. You know, maybe there's a company that doesn't have a fan page. And, you know, you can set up something really quick for them. Say, hey, you know, um, I've got this fan page if you want to buy it from me or whatever. Um, I mean, there's tons of people, like I said, restaurants nearby, guys. Um, you can find tons of restaurants that are nearby you that, prob that guarantee you probably don't have a fan page at all. So you got, I got Casa Grande, I got El Amigo. I got the Hibachi Grill uh, Supreme Buffet, um, Starbucks, okay, Golden Corral, Old Stone, um, whatever that is. I've never even heard of that one. Um, Spice Nine, never even heard of that one either. So uh, there's a lot of these places I don't even know of, um, never even heard of before. Sticky Fingers is another great restaurant I like. Um, so it looks like well, these are all these are all um, people that have fan pages, but you know, look at some of these, okay. Let's just look at some of these fan pages that they have. Okay, they're not even done. They haven't even done anything with them. Okay, they're just sitting there. So you can go in there and like definitely uh, help them out, right? So I would. I mean, that's just the way. That's the way you should do it, right? So anyway, thanks guys. I appreciate you watching this video. Uh, get in here and, and get it done, and um, you know we'll see you on the other side. All right, thanks guys.